Hi everyone, Morgan here. So we're gonna be talking about some different glassware today. Beakers versus graduated cylinders, and they come in all sizes. Now beakers look really nice. They have all these numbers on them, et cetera, et cetera, but let's be honest. The job of a beaker is to hold liquids. It's not to measure, okay? And often what you will find on beakers is this plus or minus 5%. And 5% is really big. If you're measuring 100 milliliters, okay, and plus or minus 5%, that's, you know, anywhere from 95 to 105 milliliters, okay? So let's assume that beakers are good for holding liquids, okay, and that the scale is very approximate. If you want to measure a liquid, we go to a graduated cylinder. Now, important to understand, Students often see graduated cylinders with these rings on them, and their first thought is that these rings are involved somehow in measurement. They're not. The ring is just a shock absorber so that if this is on its side, the glass doesn't hit, it's not going to break as easily. That's the whole point of those. They're a shock absorber. Okay? Now, graduated cylinders, you will notice, are much narrower. They have a scale on them also, okay? And sometimes you will see them with the letters TC or TD. TC means to contain. So if you have it exactly on 100 milliliters, that means it contains 100 milliliters. If it has the letters TD, that means to deliver. So if it has 100 milliliters and you pour it out, you're going to get exactly 100 milliliters in the other container because there'll always be a little bit that gets left behind on the walls. Okay, so to recap, beakers are great for holding and carrying liquids. Graduated cylinders are used for measuring. Okay, thanks for tuning in. This is Morgan signing off.